Hey, I'm Gopar, and today we're going to be talking about how I use org mode and org roam, a package that uses org roam, uh, to be able to do the 12 week year productivity framework. 12 week year, just like I mentioned, is another productivity framework, same, similar to GTD framework, which I covered in a previous video on how I use it on Emacs. But this is just a little video on how I use 12 week year to do it. So first thing first is since I use org roam, org roam, I created a file just for anything related to 12 week years. So these are all the plans that I have and I have them outlined. So let me quickly go over that. So I look up the node and 12 week year. So for example, if I narrow it down, there we go. Now I have this and let me zoom in and I have the 12 week year. So I just have the main ideas for the 12 week year just listed and then i have outline which is just the all of the 12 week years that i have planned so for example for 2023 i created 12 week years for the entire year now i didn't follow these to the t i changed them as i went and that is just part of life you know things happen and you need to adjust accordingly but anyways these are some things so for example for january and march i focused on something called our key tracks next was real estate investments that's what i did for those three months now uh, for for 12 week year i have something i added something personally a section called try to stay on top which is just things that are nice to have if i do them during those 12 week years 12 week uh, yeah during those three months now one thing to notice is that this is an org mode file but this is uh and this is an org mode table but these are two different things because org mode doesn't allow you to do what i wanted to do which is just create four sections like this uh, so i simply just did an easy solution and created two tables and with two headers that's pretty much it and that took care took care of that so that was pretty easy now let me show you what each what one of these files look like not each of them because that'll take some time so for example let's say i'm in april and i started a new 12 week year and the topic of choice was guitar so i pop up in guitar and now i have my own 12 week year so here are any resources that i want to learn guitar and i'm specifically interested in being able to be decent at finger picking so i said hey i'm gonna develop a plan just for myself to be able to do all these things so what i have well i create a 12 week year and i say hey week one starts in this month uh, i'm sorry in this week and these are the things that i need to do and i should mark them as done accordingly however many times i decide to practice it's like just mark them and each of these weeks have their own uh, to-do list for oops what is going on that is the wrong button but yeah, each of these have their own items, action items that I need to do for each week. And the idea is that, you know, as I go, I will simply just mark them as done or have or whatever I need to do accordingly. Now, I have leveraged uh, AI, you know, the new hotness that everybody talks about to be able to quickly create these 12 week years for me so I don't have to. So I don't have to do them myself because before I would type week one, do this, and then I started using macros and that made it easier. But it's just a whole lot easier if I just tell AI to do it for me and I will show you a quick prompt on how I did it. For example, this guitar one was created by AI just before I started recording the video. So these are all just examples that uh, ChatGPT decided to create, which is pretty nice. And I can change them accordingly because the structure is pretty much how I need it. The only thing I will need to do is just change whatever the topic is right there. There. but yeah okay so this is how you would use ChatGPT to automatically create your 12 week year goals in org mode so the first thing that i do is that i create a prompt says like hey you're an export guitarist di or something like that create a three month plan for me to become decent at finger picking i am willing to practice 20 minutes every day you know like these people how these guitar uh, icons that i look up to play and i like this this is the type of style that music that i like so how would i create something that will keep me motivated and i'll be able to do it in 20 minutes or less every day so ChatGPT is like yeah sure here's you go so it spits out a plan awesome cool month two month three there you go gives me some stuff i say hey what are some additional resources i just asked this because i was curious and then it gives me apps websites books things like that but the next part that is the most interesting part i say for the next three month i'm sorry for the three month plan rewrite it in the style of 12 week year with each week outlined with the things to do also please write it in the style of emacs org mode an example i give it an example so that it knows exactly how i want it so ai models do a much better job if you give it an example so i gave it an example of one of the things i had i changed it up just so you know it makes sense for the ai model and says all right cool 
and then after that I literally just pressed right here copy whatever it gave me and I pasted it into Emacs and as you can see this is exactly how I have it in my Emacs example I copied it and pasted it for the video and just to show you that hey you can leverage AI to do this for you and I went over here on Emacs and then I just pasted it in of course now if you can you might be able to create this with a package called ChatGPT shell uh, it's on Melpa so you can probably create the prompt there uh, there are some limits of how much it can generate uh, output things like that but I'll leave that to you but yeah I just wanted to quickly go over that if you have ChatGPT you can just use it in the browser or whatever same thing but yeah that's it next thing up is how I organize files and anything related to 12 week year well for that I'll have to show you be a diary or dear it or however you say it I call it diary but it is what it is so first thing is as that I have oh, I have right here a in my Emacs directory I have a direct another directory called org and then I have private in there which I can actually remove because everything in here is private but anyways nonetheless it is what it is and then I have a folder called org Rome. now in this org Rome, I have a few things as you can see I have a folder just for my 12 week year I have another folder just for getting things done GTD and then I have my knowledge base which I just called reference so any everything related to either of these two that will help me or just things that I want to save go into not into my knowledge base so let's jump into the 12 week year one so let's zoom in and then I have some projects right here depending on what I wanted to do. For example, I had some branding company and then cooking, you know, all these things that I've made some projects. So I have real estate investing, things like that. And I have instruments because I like to play a few instruments and it is what it is. So exactly like that. And then I have 12 week year, which is the one that I showed you guys just now. So what goes in in each of these files? Well, I'm, I'm sorry, folders. Well, it just depends on what you want. You have to do a little bit of judgment. Some of these can just go into the knowledge base themselves and you can reference them from the 12 week year file or you can create your own directory like I've done here. So for example, in the instruments file, like we just saw, we have drums, guitar, piano. So each of them are their own thing. And if I go into the violin uh, directory, it will just be supplementary exercises that I found online or I bought or whatever, just exercises for the violin. Okay, so we've covered basically most of how I use the 12 week year. It's pretty bare bones, nothing fancy at all. It's just org roam, org roam, the package, and org mode, which already comes built in into Emacs. So it's pretty straightforward, nothing fancy. I don't believe there's a package in Melpa that does something like that. Oh, one thing that I wanted to show as well that I have my own agenda view just for the weekly review stuff not I'm sorry not weekly review but for the 12 week year stuff so if I pop up my agenda buffer you can see that the letter G maps to goals 12 week year so if I press G I will simply get a view uh, let's see yeah so as you can see it is popping up the guitar stuff so I guess it says that hey this was due 17 days ago 10 days ago three days ago just things like that so this is just a nice little abuse that I can do it on the weekly review and just see what where am I track my progress and things like that well there you have it a simple little over, quick overview on how I use 12 week year within Emacs it is seriously nothing fancy or anything like that it is very straightforward I'm curious about if anybody else does the 12 week year in Emacs and how do you do it do you think I'm not being efficient do you think my solution is a lot more simpler do you have something do you think I should try just let me know because remember knowledge grows when it is shared thank you